Hello, welcome to another Mad Hatter review. So, let's talk Thundercats, all right? Thundercats, they're on the move, they're loose, okay? Well, this is not loose yet, but it will be, okay, once I take it out of the package. So, I got this Lion-O from Target, uh, found them on the shelves. Uh, I do want to say it was very exciting finding, like, a Thundercat on, on, just on the shelves. It's been... God knows how long since I seen, I went into the store and I saw not just a Thundercat, but this kind of like this black packaging with the white in the back, this art here, which I always love this art. This is like from the eighties, this art. Um, it always bothered me that there was no, there's no Wiley kit uh, on this, on this art, but um, I just, I don't know, super throwback. Packaging's great. I do have a monkey in that I already opened up in this model. So if you don't know, this is sort of like part of like the $35 model for uh, Super 7. Super 7 started um, kind of quietly, I don't know, a few months ago, um, taking products that normally cost like $55, like uh, uh, Notorious B.I.G., um, ODB, and uh, giving you like a scaled down version. Scaled down meaning like took out a bunch of accessories put it on card, doesn't have like a ton of the boxing and charging 35 for that. Now, I made a video saying that I do like that as a model. I do like, okay, you can knock, knock $20 off. I think the controversy was it costs 35 and 35 is still, 35 is still a lot of money. Okay. For $35, you know, you get, there's, if you're talking about competitively in the market, there's a lot of stuff that you can get for $35 that, that, some would argue um, has more to it, okay? Now, this Lion-O represents like a re-sculpt. Uh, they first uh, sculpted this Lion-O with the glowing eyes. They showed that at STCC. I had that on pre-order. At the time, even when I was at STCC, I couldn't tell if he had like a normal face, meaning like a face without like light up eyes. Because I was like, looking at him from my vantage point, I was like, okay, so the body... Looks pretty good, but, um, and I wish I had that other Lionel right here to compare it to, but like, it looks like it's like a leaner Lionel, like the body aesthetic looks better than the one that I remember with that, that buck that they've been using forever from classics or whatever. Um, but I want like a normal head. So then, um, but, but it didn't look like it came with one. It was just like the $55 version, but then they had like a $35 version and that was this one. And this one was supposed to come with this head. So this is a head that was advertised. Now, that's a great lion o head. It, it, tragically, that's not the head that you're going to get, okay? If it came with that head, that would mean a lot. <laughs> this would be a different... I think tonally, this would be a different video. Um, I already took a look at the face here. It's not as bad as some people are making it out to be. But it's also... It's just okay, okay. I, 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 I'll, I'll show you guys like a closer look, um, but face aside, and trust me, there's like I, I, I don't know why. I mean, it's like can they just print one and just see what it looks like before they just print all of them? I don't, like, can't you just verify that that's the way it's going to come out? Because that's a it's a big deal. Like the face is the biggest deal. It, like, like if the symbol was kind of askew or some other stuff. I think you could tolerate it, but like it's like ha, like a figure has to have a nice face. People pay a lot of money for custom heads because like sometimes the head makes the figure. So I don't know. That, that's it's just like a pet, not a pet peeve. I mean that's a, like a legitimate pet peeve makes it sound like it's like it's like it's minuscule, but like that's like a legitimate thing. It's like same thing with Chitara. It's like can you print out the head and just make sure that that's going to be what the head looks like before like you just you know, hit the button in the factory and just start making a ton of them because like the body looks real good. I think this could have been a, like a complete win, but there's another thing that might stop it from that. It's uh, the $35 price. So I opened this, uh, this monkey and let me just bring it right here. Uh, this one right here. Now, this is a nice figure, but he was also a nice figure in his $55 form. Um, some would argue you don't need a lot of stuff. A monkey and figure, this is all I need. I need him and the mace, and really that's it. So I do like that model. I do like the scaled down model. The issue is that 
that I think people might have, and I'm feeling, I'm feeling it too when I'm looking at this stuff, is like 35 is still too much. You know what I mean? It's like 35, it's perception. 35 for one figure plus one thing, the perception of that, it just, it just hurts. Um, if I'm being real honest, I, I know Super 7, is Super 7 Boutique? I don't know. I don't know what they're considered, but it doesn't feel like $35. And I have the same thing with this, um, with this Lionel right here. I'm going to open it up. I want to take a look at it. But you get Lionel, you get the sword and the claw. Now, Lionel is probably the one that should come with the most stuff, okay? So, you know, maybe, maybe that presence is missed with this character. But, again, I think, like, even though... It just goes to show you like how wild the prices were at $55. If even at $35, you're like going like, oh, am I getting what I need to get? So that's all. I just want to say like, I, I, I like the model. I liked it there. And, and again, maybe it's because like some of the stuff is, is are figures that came out. Maybe moving forward, if they had new characters at the $35 model, it would mean something different. But I still feel, I don't know, like $25. Can you do 25? Like 25 is like a like feel this. If I'm looking at this, I'm feeling like this is like 20 to 25, knowing other stuff that's out there, even with the boutique curve. I don't know. But um, let's open this Lino up. I'm dying to take a look at him because, again, so it's pretty much head to toe a new Lino. And uh, let's just see. Let's see in hand if uh, if I feel better about it. Right, we're back. Uh, this is nice. This is a nice Lino. Okay, um, I like him a lot more out of package. Uh, the body they used here, oh man, here's the tough thing. It's like, this is, a, this is a good body, okay? This is a good, I mean, I would even argue great Lionel body. The thing is, it's not gonna scale well with some of the other Thundercats is, the, is now what's gonna happen. You know, like Tigra should be, sort of thinner than lion is, you know what I mean? And then like, like Panthro, my, like that's my fear. So I guess the question is, do they, do they remake that or what? But um, I like this, uh, I think this, whoever, yes, the body, great job on this. Uh, legs are a little pale, like the skin is a little pale. It's not that big a deal to me. The face still bugs me a bit because I, I just saw what it could have been, but it is better out of the package. You know what it is? It's like, it's almost like it got elongated or something in production. Something just happened in production, but I don't know. It's it's not, it, it, it's, I'm being very honest. Like it, it is better out of package, okay? The paint applications are nice. They're clean. Um, I, I really love the gold on the, um, on, the uh, on the glove there and uh, yeah. I think this is a nice line. I just, again, it's just, it, it, you, you, you're like wanting perfection. I don't know. This Thundercats is one of those things because they never, I don't think there's been any Thundercat line that ever nailed it completely. Okay. LJM was its own thing. So I'm, I'm, I'm not counting that, but, uh, but um, I am, I am pleasantly surprised at this line. Okay. I, I, I think out of package, it's much more impressive and it's like, it's funny, like the angles, like here, like the, the face is much better, but then here it's just kind of, it's, <laughs> I don't know. Um, I, I wish, I will say this, I do wish that there was more articulation. That's always the thing with Super 7, okay? It's still like the knees, the elbows. I don't know why they just can't um, uh, be double, you know, double jointed and um, just go all the way because, I don't know, you get the posability just... You, you just want it for this guy. And he, it looks like he would be, would have that posability. You know what I mean? Like if you were to look at his body, you would imagine that. Now he's got a ton of posability just like on the chest and the, the waist and like just how the, the chest swivels and like, there's a lot of that. But yeah, it's just like in the, in just the, the knees and the elbows, just like the same kind of like 90 degrees, um, 90 degree stuff happening. So um, has something to be desired, but definitely much better than uh, than I thought that it would be. Okay, dare I say, 
that this lion o is is growing on me big time okay i i i i i'm liking it which scares me because it's like is this guy gonna fit how is he gonna fit with the others i don't know meaning the other thundercats like like i i, I might have sort of like a clunky kind of look and does that mean they remake the others or is this kind of like a one-off a lot of nice stuff happening with this figure look how much you can go back look at that okay just leaping at you and uh can move forward the problem is it's like you don't have the knees to offset the moving forward okay this should be this should have been should have been a slam dunk in terms of like the knee, the knee should have been like a double jointed knee, and so the elbow. These are cats. These are where's the where's the picture of all the Thundercat? Look, look how they're crouching. Look, look at that. I, I want to do this. I want to do this, <laughs> and I can't. I can't. God damn it. So um, yeah. So, so I, I guess final verdict for this Lionel, which I was eagerly anticipating, is it is better than I thought it was going to. Well, I will say this. Face did not come out as good as I wanted it to in terms of the renders. Seems to be like a Super 7 thing where, where that happens, okay? I, I really wish that would stop. Um, but the figure itself, I'm more impressed than I thought I would be. But there are still some things that are still lacking, okay? And I don't want to get like another lion -O down the road that now this one is double-jointed. You know what I mean? Like I just just have like one perfect line or one perfect line it would be just great like the quintessential quintessential uh, quintessential cartoon lionel okay because nobody's come out with that okay even mondo as much as i like mondo their lionel is like an artistic take lionel you know what i mean that's not like the quintessential cartoon lionel and i think a lot of people want you know, people see like, I'm trying to do like a two-handed thing. People see like the, the, the NECA cartoon turtles and they go, well, where's XYZ version of this? Where's the, where's the other dedicated cartoon lines? Like, why, why doesn't Lion-O get that? I mean, I sort of got it. But uh, anyway, um, yeah, look, he can do a lot. He can do, he can do the splits. He can do what he needs to do. But um, I just, um, and he has like a drop-down hip too, which is... Yeah, this is, it's a, it's a step in the right direction, but I want him, I want it to be perfect, okay? Dare I ask for, or somewhat close to, when I say perfect, I mean like, like there have been other things that I consider them like, just like if, if this had the same quality, like let's say one of those like NECA turtles, like if, if, if this line of could, it, could just be as cartoon accurate as like something like that, or somewhat cartoon accurate, um, I think I'd be happy. This is nice. This is a really nice line. Oh, um, it's just not exactly one thing. Face is not exactly promised what was promised. And the, the bigger question, for $35, do you, I still feel like it's getting my money's worth? I don't, okay? I still feel like there's some ways to go, okay? Especially if there's not that many accessories. I mean, 35 bucks, and that's before tax, if you give me that plus one accessory, the thing I buy better be immaculate. You know what I mean? So anyway, that's it. Just uh, I've been eagerly uh, awaiting this Lino. It's one of my favorite characters ever from one of my favorite cartoons ever. And um, I am happy to have this. Um, and even this by extension, even though I have another monkey in. Um, it was just cool. Just again, saw this on the store and just getting this. I was just like, yeah, uh, very cool. So um Hope to, uh, very curious what their plans are moving forward. I can't wait to get that cat's layer. This guy's going to look great in front of the cat's layer. And uh, that is all. Uh, let me know what you guys think about this. Uh, know, did it turn to a rant video? It's just sort of, I don't know. My, I wanted to be comprehensive in this one because I thought it deserved it. So, um, yeah, give me your thoughts as well. Comment, subscribe, drop me a like. See you next time. Bye-bye.